awakening in Israel over the past two weeks has given birth to the most impressive protest movement in the past 40 years. The movement consists of university students, members of the middle class who can no longer meet their economic responsibilities, single mothers, and residents of socio-economically disempowered neighborhoods. The political policy that is used in the country today is not working, and this is the reason for all the problems. There is a political policy that is the basis for this problem. What do people want to do today? Tomorrow, on the third day, on Thousands of people have occupied Israel's squares and hundreds of thousands have marched against Israel's neoliberal government. The question of housing stands at the center of the protest movement. אנחנו פה מיום חמישי, אבל המאבק שלנו התחיל כבר בינואר. פינו אותנו מהבתים של שכירות שאנחנו לא עומדים בשכירויות. ואני חושבת שאנחנו, כן, אנחנו רוצות בית. Following its initial shock, the government believes the protest will not continue past September, when children return to school and universities reopen. However, there must be an appropriate solution for the hundreds of families in the protest tents scattered throughout the country who have nowhere else to go.